In this video, I am going to show you how to adjust the thickness of a horizontal line in Google Docs. So there may be times when you're working in your file where you want to add a horizontal line between sections because this can make it easier to tell when one section ends and another section begins. So a little formatting can sometimes make your files look a lot nicer. And so one thing you might want to do is adjust the thickness of your horizontal line to have more control over the look of your document. So there are several different ways to change the thickness of a line, but ultimately it depends on how the line was created. There are a few different ways of adding a horizontal line in your file, and each way has a different way of adjusting the thickness of the line. So what I'm going to show in this video are four different ways of adding a horizontal line in your file and then how you would adjust the thickness according to the way that the line was created. So first, what I'm going to show is the easiest method of adding a horizontal line in your file. However, it is also the most limited in the ways you can adjust its thickness. So the easiest way to add a horizontal line is to come up into this top menu and select insert horizontal line. And so now I have this horizontal line. And if you want to change its thickness, the only real option you have is to select the highlight color tool. And what you would probably want to do is select a color closest to the color of your horizontal line. So I'm just going to do black here. And you can see I now have a much thicker line. Now one thing you will notice is that it is not the same exact color as my horizontal line. You can still see that running all the way across. So this is the only option you have. You can only make the line thicker with the highlight tool. So again, this is the easiest way of adding a horizontal line. It's also the worst way of changing its thickness because you are very limited. So that is the first way. The second way, we are also using the highlight tool. So what you wanna do is select in your file where you want the line to appear and then select highlight color and then what you want to do is choose the thickness of your line. So change your font size according to how thick you want the line. If you want it thinner, use a smaller font size. If you want it thicker, choose a larger font size. So maybe I will do a five font size. And then what you want to do is press the underscore key on your keyboard. And as you continually press this, it will then create the line all the way across your file. And so this is a better method because you have more control over the thickness of your line because you can adjust the font size. However, it is a little more tedious because you have to manually type the line all the way across, but this might work for you if you really need to change its thickness. So I'm just pressing the underscore key. You could also use the dash key. It will work the same way. So that is the second method of adding a horizontal line and changing its thickness. So the third option that we have is using the drawing editor to add a line into your file. So what you wanna do is select wherever in your file you want the line to appear and then come up to insert drawing new and then the drawing editor will appear on your screen. What you wanna do from here is select this line tool. And then in the drawing editor, you click, hold, and drag. And so I'm gonna create this line all the way across, and now I have my line. And when your line is selected, you can come up to this line weight option. And from here, you can change its thickness by choosing a line weight. And so I will go with a four point line weight for pixels. Um, you also have some other options. You can change it to a dash line if you want. So you have a few different types of dash lines and you also have the line color here. And so when you're done, you can select save and close and now you have a line in your file. So that is another good option because you can easily adjust the thickness of your line. And the last option I'm going to show is using paragraph borders to create and adjust the thickness of a line. So what you want to do here is select format paragraph styles and then this borders and shadings option. And from here, we can select between border and border width. 
this is where you're gonna choose um, the size of your line so I will do three you can also change it to a dash line or adjust the color here and then when you press apply now it will create a line whenever I have a new paragraph so basically anytime I press enter or return on my keyboard it is now going to create that line according to the thickness that I set in the settings and so you can just press enter wherever you want to line and it will quickly insert that line into your file. So those are four different ways to not only add a horizontal line into your file, but also to adjust its thickness. And so those are the best ways. I always recommend if you are learning to try each method, eventually you'll figure out which one is your favorite. But that's it for this video. Just let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.